All right, everybody, welcome back, or I should say, welcome to my first Clash of Clans episode, or I guess video that I'm gonna be doing. So I'm a little late uh, to the update. I wanted to cover the update a while ago, but I just never got around to it. But I guess better late than never, kinda. It's like over a week, but uh, anyway, I mean, we're at my base right now. This is like my main account, my main base. This, this is everything I have like going for me. And let's just look over this update real quick. So my, uh, well, there's a lot of stuff going on. So my impressions of this update is honestly, it is very lackluster. Like despite everything you see in the screen, uh, there's only like really two features, I guess. Cause like th there's really nothing in this update. This, this was a very lackluster update. So the first feature that everybody is like, is, well, kind of complaining, kind of praising, it's very controversial, is the Builder's Apprentice. So you get to get another builder, well, kinda another builder that you can assign to uh, whatever whatever shit is being built by the other builders and it'll help your, uh, your stuff build faster. So, I mean, I have the Apprentice Builder right here. Uh, well, he just finished uh, building something with the other builder and uh, now I have an available builder. I it literally just finished like maybe an hour ago. So I already maxed him out because I have the gems to do it and I don't really spend gems on anything else. I know Supercell does things like this and they just release things and all of a sudden it costs a shitload of gems. So that's why I'm always ready. And I don't spend gems on anything other than, um, well, nothing really. I actually don't spend gems at all now I think about it. So yeah, they've been just been like saving up and now I got to use them. So I maxed out the apprentice builder. So one thing I do agree with everyone though, is that he needs a buff. You only get eight hours a day of value from him. And then like he's down the whole day. And then there's another like thing that you gotta worry about. Like you already have to upgrade all your stuff. You gotta check your lab, you gotta check your pets, you gotta clear your bushes, you gotta, oh my God, dude, you gotta do a lot of chores in this fucking game. And now you gotta make sure your apprentice builder is working. Cause he has like, a 23 hour cooldown so every single day you got to make sure you assign him on something or you're losing value out of your gems because you didn't assign him like yesterday i already forgot first day i forgot ever since i got him in the first day of the update yesterday i already forgot I, oh my god it's gonna happen it's gonna happen so i think they need to like tweak him a bit make him worth your money make him like less of a hassle to assign to builders, make him like kind of a permanent, like until something is done, then he like, becomes available. Like do something like that. Cause this guy is just adding another chore to the base. And there's so many fucking things you gotta do, man. You gotta log in your base. You gotta check your war attacks. If you're in war, you gotta like check your, all your storages, like collect all your stuff. Oh my God, fill donations, request troops, dude. If we can add some more simplicity to this game, that would be great. Because right now, every time you log on, it's like overwhelming. You got like 10 fucking things to do as soon as you log on. So, yeah. In conclusion, I don't know why people are defending like this apprentice builder. He's expensive as shit. He doesn't really help that much. I don't know why people are defending Supercell all the time. I think we should all agree to get as much value and like uh stuff from supercell because i mean they're they're making a shitload of money and like there's already pay to win stuff like look at these ores man you got to pay for all this stuff you can't get it no other way and if you can technically but it's very limited it's not like you can go in a raid right now and just be farming that left and right so yeah like i was saying in conclusion Apprentice Builder needs a buff. People need to stop defending him that way he is. They need to stop praising Superstar like they're some sort of hero. Like, y'all need to stop with that shit. This guy needs a buff. He's just, it's, it kind of sucks, let's be honest. And uh, another thing, that, well, that was like kind of half of the update. The other half of the update was the healer troop, which I have yet to unlock because I have my barracks building still for like six more days. So don't you love that, guys? Don't you love it when there's new content and either you're too low of a town hall to unlock it or you just, it, it takes days or weeks to unlock it. I fucking love that. So I don't know what this troop does. I, well, I know what he does. He heals your troops and he turns into a bear, 
but I don't know how good he is. I don't know if he's gonna be like a new meta troop because I haven't used him. I, I can't unlock him yet. He's still he's still right there. How long is it? Six days until he's unlocked? That's a long fucking time, guys. I gotta wait for a whole other week. So and then if I use the apprentice builder, like I got so much loot and stuff going on, I can't use the apprentice builder on him because I gotta get these builders free as soon as possible so I I can get more shit. Anyway. That guy's like the other half of the update, and then there's just a bunch of irrelevancy. At least if you're max like me, Town Hall 16. Maybe if you're Town Hall 11, Town Hall 12. I mean, these time and cost reductions are gonna help you. For me, they don't mean shit. Uh, quality of life changes, uh, not really anything uh, like groundbreaking. This is not not anything like that's gonna help a lot. Now I'm looking. I'm barely looking at this. And then bugs, okay. Like, th that's all, guys. Hard mode with friends. I I'm not gonna use hard mode. Why am I gonna make this game harder for me? I, I suck at the game. I need it to be as easy as possible. Um, oh, and then you can check, like, the range of stuff. I have not used that yet. And that's it. <laughs> guys, that's it. That's the update. The June update. The June updates are usually really juicy. There was one June update where the builder base came out. That was enormous. But now, this update is, like, extremely lackluster. So overall, update uh, kind of sucks. I'm just gonna be honest. There's really nothing happened here. Not really anything new. I mean, we'll see how the druid plays, but uh, other than that, it's like, eh. There's been way better updates before. Uh, if they were to make a good change, I would say, whenever I donate to these people. Refill my troops automatically. That would be a, a great change. Because I have to, like, donate, and then I gotta remember what troops I donated. And then I gotta, like, train those specific troops back into my army because I'm missing them. Or make a donation barracks or something. Like, Supercell. You guys, you guys encourage so much teamwork. But, like, you make it so inconvenient to donate to people. God, man. Uh, anyway, I'm just, I'm clearing all my vegetation. Because I, I barely, uh... Log on, log on, and I have a builder available. So I mean, this is my chance. I'm talking about the update. So that's kind of what I wanted to do. I might make videos going over like Reddit comments or Reddit like posts because people are always arguing there. So that seems pretty interesting. I'm also gonna just upgrade my shit here, do two attacks and dip. Um, so yeah, I, I all this stuff. I have a uh, laboratory guy, or I guess my lab is open. They, these things just opened an hour or two ago. I wanted to record all this and make a video before I like send these things to back to work. So I think we're done discussing the update. I think I can finally get back to the game. You guys can, I, I guess, see two attacks or something. I don't know. Um, I got other comments to make as I'm progressing with this video. But first, let me see what I'm going to do here. So I got a... I'm kind of dry here, guys. Look at my things. I'm kind of dry. Don't have that many resources here. Um, I, I got a spell book. I don't know when Town Hall 17 is coming. I kind of want to save a stock up books for Town Hall 17, but no idea when that's coming. I got 362,000 Dark Elixir and my jellyfish is done in three days. So I'm going to overflow pretty soon if I don't have something like in here. I don't know. I'm planning to start working on a spirit fox so I can put him with the world champion. And, uh, well, I'll do the other useless troops after that. Because Lassie and Electric Owl are, like, completely useless. So, let's let's do this, guys. Let's upgrade the Overgrowth spell. Because it is going to be, like, the spell that I need to upgrade right now with my uh, spell book. So, let's do that. Here we go, guys. So, Overgrowth is maxed. And now I'm gonna use uh, all my elixir to upgrade another troop. Uh, I don't really have any useful troops to upgrade. It's like, uh, it's like, what do I upgrade? The the barbarian puppet and the archer puppet are already like kind of nullified, making this useful to upgrade these fucking things. So I might as well just upgrade the wizard. I don't know. It, it, it's really like a dead end here. I have nothing else to upgrade in this lab. So let's do that. All right, so now I'm dry on Elixir and Dark Elixir. Let's also upgrade, uh, I don't know. I kind of need gold because that's all I really have left. So let's upgrade, uh, oh, just fucking Seeking Mine. I think that's it. I think we're good. Uh, I need to leave this clan, by the way. Look, they, they always lose. 
they always fucking lose, man. Look how many times I lost, and they don't even wore that frequently. And I'm in Masters 3. Masters 3. I need to be in, like, Masters 1 at least. Goddamn, bro. I need to get the fuck out. But I'll do that later. But for now, let me just do an attack. Uh, Should I collect this? I'm going to forget. Uh, I'm going to forget. I'm going to collect it. Also, the streak stuff keeps breaking. I think I'm good now. But... It kept breaking, and it was really annoying. So let's get to work, guys. Let's go attack people. I'm in Legends League, so like I got limited amount of attacks. Also, I need to do clan games. I forgot. Clan games. Guys, we're going to do your clan games. They're, they're running uh, running like fast. All right. Got a full army. Probably not going to have a full army next time I do an attack, but oh well. Let's... Uh, I don't know. I'm using Root Rider. I'm using the same army I was using before the Root Riders got nerfed. Fucking Supercell nerfed the Root Riders as soon as CWL was about to start. What fucking pieces of shit. 50% attack damage nerf. Are you kidding me? Who does that? I've never seen a game developer do that. Oh my god. If you gotta nerf something like 50%, you seriously fucked up something. You didn't even test your shit. Anyway, let's get into this, guys. Root Riders are so OP. Let's send all these motherfuckers here. This guy, this base is like really easy to funnel. Wow. Oh. Man, this is a little loud. Alright. Send Rage. I'm gonna uh, use a spell right now, the Healing Tome and the invis Invincibility right now. Because there's a lot of shit going on. Oh my god. This is uh, chaotic. Let me send Clone Spell. I don't know why I'm cloning, but we're cloning something. As, as long as something is being cloned, it's, it's, it's good in my book. Uh, let's send the Royal Champion over here. I'm not really good at this game, disclaimer. I, I'm really, I really am trash. That's why when they nerf something, I get pissed because... There's no point in learning strategies if they're just going to nerf everything you do. So, I'm going to throw another Rage there. I'm not going to have all these spells available. This base is really easy. Wow, this base got demolished. I tried using Sir Moose's uh, army composition for post-nerf Root Riders. Guys, I got demolished. His, his armies never work. I always try to use his armies, like his Electro Dragons and all that, but they don't fucking work. I don't know if I'm just incompetent. Or if I'm using them wrong, but his armies fucking suck, man. I, I can never get them right. Anyway, we got that. Or uh, wow, we got a lot of loot. Look at that, 170% more loot uh, for my bonus right there. So I got a, yeah, I got a pretty big chunk right there, man. It's a pretty good payout. And we got all this stuff here. Wow, we're rich. Uh, let's see how much ores I have. I need to leave this clan, like I was saying earlier, because these motherfuckers are dragging me down. They're gonna cost me. For, um, getting like all those equipments uh, if you saw the leaks there's new equipment like three new epic equipment I need to get the fuck out this is way too much you guys are sandbagging me anyway let's do one more attack uh shit dude one day left I'm not I'm probably not gonna reach the, the 4,000 probably not um alright let's let's continue how many days are left in the season Four days. Four days and a half. Okay. Well, let's do one more attack. Uh, I guess I might as well request. Alright, let's go, guys. So, yeah, update overall. I don't know. I'm only playing half of the update because the other half is still working in my base. I, I don't know what the fucking druid does. So, this base is a little more... Uh, not, uh, not... I wouldn't say challenging. It's like... I don't know, I need to think more. So, I kind of, I want to funnel everything. Like, that's what made that last attack so good, is I got easy funneling. But this base is like, uh, I'm gonna do here, I'm gonna put the ice golem here. I'm gonna put the barracks right there. Oh, the ice golem's going to the thing over there. All right, well, I'm gonna put a root rider here. I just want everything to funnel. I want everything to funnel. Oh my God, that root rider's gonna die because of the single one for now. All right, that might be good. Alright, so the single inferno is gonna be a complete asshole. He's gonna like destroy everything here. I'm gonna put skeletons so he can stop killing all my shit. Right, yeah, I want everything in there. Uh I don't know if my Barb King and like Queen can get in there. Shit, I can't. Well, doesn't matter. These this army is like really brain dead. You just send things in and it does things. Oh. So let's duplicate those guys. Send another thing in there. Uh put that in there. I'm gonna put throw on my fucking world champion there. Yo, I'm just throwing shit left and right, and somehow it still all works. I'm gonna put uh, the tome right there, so these guys can start healing and be protected. The new warden ability is like really OP. I'm gonna get that. I think it's a torch. OP as fuck. Put a freeze there because he's melting all my shit. Uh, let's start deploying cleanup, I guess. Oh my god, a real champion's already dead. 
Wow, and I still need to deal with CC troops. Fuck. Probably not going to win. Oh, I need to upgrade or activate your ability. Damn, my king is dying fast, bro. Oh my god. You have 65% um, protection. Hey, you guys didn't protect that. Thank you. I'll just take all your dark elixir. Well, I lost. Too much shit going on. I got a one star. Fuck, guys. You see, I'm not good at this game. Oh, no, never mind. Never mind. I got a two star. Hey, I'll take it. Uh, I'm going to send Goblin. Nope. Goblin's not going to be able to do it. Well, kind of one. Not really. Two star here. 90%. If I had the CC troops and I guess extra rage spell, would have been better. But, oh, well. That's all I can do. So, that's going to be it for this video, guys. Um, oh, you got rage spell. That's gonna be it for this video. I gotta finish up these climb games. I gotta keep. I gotta keep playing, uh, cause I'm man, I'm like behind on all this stuff. Oh, also, climb game rewards suck dick. Hero book lost all its value ever since the update with the heroes, and uh, there's so much to discuss in this game. I'm just gonna like briefly go over things, and then I'll just end the video because it's getting way too long. So, unlimited heroes event doesn't mean shit to me. I already maxed all my heroes. They need to do something about the heroes being down. Because you can, like, half the game, half the name of the game is Clash of Clans. Like, that's not even the game. How are you going to Clash of Clans if your heroes are down? You can't attack without heroes, man. You need heroes, especially now that they have equipment. You need those motherfuckers up. So, you can't play the game. You can't play the name of the game if you don't have your heroes. So, they got to fix that up. And I don't know what it's fair play. Like, getting rid of bots or something. I never had an issue with bots. But, anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed. I got to get the fuck out of this clan soon. Um, I'll post another video. Let me know what you want. Do you want that reddit review of what people are saying on reddit? Do you want me to do attacks? I don't know any attacks. I suck at everything. Do you want me to just talk about the game ramble? I don't know. Let me know what you guys want. Let me know what you guys feel about this video and I'll see you in the next recording. Whatever I do in Clash of Clans.